News 18's Vinnie Martirano is live along the Wabash River with Lafayette Mayor Tony Rosorski's reaction to the results. Vinnie? Yeah, we're just about six miles downstream from when the IEDC has been testing their site number one for the LEAP project. Lafayette Mayor Tony Rosworski says he wasn't too surprised to see what the test results came back and showed them, but there's still a lot more information he needs to know before he can fully say he's on board with the plan. Starting off, keeping things on Lafayette's end, he wants to know exactly how many gallons that it would take away from the aquifers here in Tippecanoe County. Rosworski's concerned with the absolute number that they plan to pull compared to having the range that they originally told him. To see the set number of gallons rather than a range. Another area Rosworski wants to see more data for is how much the aquifer recharges. The data shows how the recharges over a short period of time, but Rosworski wants to see how it'll last way down the road for Tippecanoe County. Roseworski wants to make sure plans if some type of consensus can be reached and we believe this will work that that pipe only be built for that amount of water not like we're only going to take this much now but we're actually going to put a pipe in that can do double. Roseworski is also looking forward to seeing the independent study reviews from outside sources. And Roseworski says we're still a long way out from hearing what is going to happen with Tippecanoe County and the effects that pulling this amount of water from the aquifers in Tippecanoe County is going to have. Reporting live from the Wabash River, Vinnie Monterano, News 18.